So we're here at what used to be a Boy Scout camp. Now that they've been bankrupted by the leftist legal uh, party there and uh, no longer exist, I imagine this area will just uh, get overgrown. But once upon a time, I bet that there were troops that came in here and camped, did group camping. Picnic tables are still in pretty good shape. I did, uh, I did enjoy looking at the bathroom here. Check this out. <laughs> oh yeah, I remember these days. There it is. Oh, there we go. <laughs> yeah, so anyway, it's too bad. It kind of seems like a, a whole different world, isn't it? And uh, yeah, they did have a men's and women's. That was the women's bathroom. So, and it looks like the little little prayer area where they probably had a fire pit at once upon a time. So I just get nostalgic sometimes looking at all this and seeing it get destroyed. But um, yeah, that's the world we're living in. Well, you can you can see these these bathrooms haven't been used in a long time. Look at that. Oh my goodness. All right. Well, let's get get going. We're gonna hike up to that primitive camping area and see what it looks like. So this is uh, the Torilla Challenge Trail. At least I found the trailhead. So that's pretty cool. And uh, there's a mark on the tree there. So Torilla Trail. I guess this is going that way. But we're gonna go ahead and turn around. I'm gonna take that right back there and see if that leads up towards the primitive camping. And uh, if it doesn't, well, oh well. So, you know, once again, I'm kind of hiking down this dirt road. Can't imagine why it's here. And then you see something like that. I guess it was a metal grate once upon a time. And they even have a, looks like for water here, drainage system. But I'm just, <laughs> I'm just back here in the woods. I, Wonder what that was once upon a time, you know? Anyway, so I've been hiking. Well, I mean, you can see the marks on the trees, so this is supposed to be a trail. Now, this is pretty cool. I mean, it's a little bridge just over this uh, creek here. Yeah, you kind of see it down there. No sign of that primitive camping area, and uh, actually the trail back here goes up into the woods. I wonder if that's going up towards it. We'll go a little further. I mean, boy, I tell you, talk about having fun in a Jeep. When if you came back in here, you, <laughs> I mean, I don't, not many SUVs could climb this, but uh, it would be it'd be fun. So this is that right fork I was telling you about. But I don't see, you know, you'd think they'd have something marking if this is really leading to the primitive camping area, which I doubt it is. We'll, we'll go up in there a ways and see what we see. I, I I'm not dressed with my gear on, so I, I can't go if the trail gets kind of kind of spooky, then I gotta just come back and hike hike out of here. All right, I'm not equipped for this trail. This is the third spider, check him out. I've already busted through two spider webs. And if you don't know me, I hate spiders. I mean, I don't hate them, they, they serve their purpose. I'm not gonna kill them, but I hate getting them on my face. So I don't know, wouldn't mind going, keep going further, but uh, we're gonna give up on that primitive campground. I'll, I'll go back and talk to the rangers about it. So let's head on back. So coming in, whew, feeling it. You know, just came up that. So I saw this, this new do not enter sign. Now, if you just kind of look around, <laughs> I mean, we're just back here in the woods and there's not many vehicles that could get, make it in, on this road. So what in the world is do not enter? So guess what we're gonna do? We're gonna enter. We got, I gotta see what this is. See now, this makes no sense at all. So we're pretty far, we're pretty far back in here with that do not enter sign. And you can see there's a trail. It's marked by that and there's your post. Going down here, I imagine that's probably a portion of champions. So, what was it? Oh, here it goes. So it comes out here. Look, and then it, I guess it just goes down the road a bit and then goes that way. Now we hiked pretty far back in here on this uh, dirt road. I So why, why they said do not enter, I really don't understand. Um, but this is Champions here, it looks like. I guess it's Champions, marked in orange. 
So it's kind of going on down that way. Probably be a good trail to hike, but uh, we're not gonna hit that today. Anyway, I guess we'll head on back. It's, it's hotter than blue blazes out here. And I've already had one shower and I'm gonna get a second shower as soon as I get back. So I'm just gonna go a little further down this road just to see what I can see. But I really don't understand do not enter other than maybe they just wanted you to stay on that blue trail back there, which doesn't make sense. So, let's see if you see what I'm saying. It just kind of winds around. Wouldn't be a bad trail to hike, you know. If they went, oh, here it goes. Looks like it's coming up on a fence. Oh, so I bet that that's probably some private property back there. But still, it would be nice to hike up that road to get to that entranceway on the trail. So, yeah, maybe this is... Uh, Somebody's hunting land, be my guess. I'd be real curious. I gotta, if I get a ranger when I get back, I'll ask him what that is. Maybe that's uh, probably uh, some somebody's land or for hunting or whatever. All right, well, we can turn around now. I'm glad I entered. Well, if I was really curious, look at this. Gate's not even locked. So, and you can see the fence is in bad shape. So what this land is used for, who knows? But uh, I don't think it's hunting season. If I wasn't so tired, I'd go on back in there a little way, see if I saw something. But yeah, I'm ready to get back and relax and read a book and probably pass out in my chair and uh, let the bugs eat me. I already got bit by one of them fire ants. Boy, and just one of them little suckers hurt like hell. I was like, man, you know, back home, I never, I've never been bit. But I had one on my foot and I really wasn't worried about it until he bit me. And I was like, hey, how could a little teeny little ant <laughs> hurt so much? All right, man. that's it for today.